Hi, it's Miss Alyssa here, and this is my assistant, Brooks, and we're gonna show you how to make marble paper today. First, we're gonna talk about our supplies. We're gonna use shaving foam, a squeegee, some food coloring, um, something to stir it with. We're gonna use a popsicle stick. I've got an old sheet pan, and to protect our surface, we have a garbage bag and some butcher paper. We also, you also need a blank sheet of paper and a squeegee. So, Brooks, what is the first thing you're going to do? So, you're going to take the shaving cream and squirt it all There you go, bud. So, you're spraying that directly on the sheet pan. It's okay if it makes that noise. You're just lumping it all over there. There's no rhyme or reason. All right, what is our next step, bud? So you're... Next. You're going to take some food coloring, spray it all... Take grits, get them all over it. You can use anything, but basically you can use food coloring. Okay, keep going, bud. Next, you're going to take a few more types. And just drip it all over the shaving cream. Right now, I've used blue and red. Ooh, I think that's a good combination. Why don't you take your popsicle stick next and then you're gonna swirl it around. Okay, once it's swirled, what do you do next? You're going to take a piece of paper, like this, a blank one. You're going to get on the shaving cream, and then you're going to lightly um, squish it on. And you're trying to get all the sides open. Okay. Next, What's next? You're going to flip it over. You're going to move the pan. You're going to move the pan. Just trying to make it straight. Okay. Now what's next? You're going to get a squeegee, and then you're going to hardly push it. Really you're going to push it on there really firm, and then this is the final product. Marble paper. If you just go over it one time, It'll work best because then you're not going to get the white behind your paper all messed up. Or you can just keep going over it. And then the finished product is going to look like this. Thank you, Brooks.